Hello everyone, welcome to Everybody Loves Zippers. Today we are going to be showing you how to fix a small cosmetic bag where the slider has come completely off. Let's jump into it. Okay, so what we're going to do today is first of all, I want to thank Lily from Illinois for bringing this bag to our attention. Um, we're going to be repairing her bag here. So what we're going to be doing is first, because the sliders totally come off, we need to clip off a couple teeth here at the top to make room for the slider to go on. Once we clip off the teeth here, we're going to manually close the zipper or what I call buttoning the zipper up to the top. We'll put the slider back on, put on some top stops, and it will be completely functional. So I'm gonna zoom in here a little bit. So what we're gonna be doing first is cutting the teeth off. Uh, you can see here that there are just a couple teeth that we're gonna need to cut off. That, that, what that does is gives us some room to put on the slider. Um, and the top stops, when we put them on, it's gonna cover that up. So it will look like the, that no teeth are have ever been cut off, but we need to make some room so the slider can go on. So we're just using our pliers that you may have seen in other videos. Um, we're gonna go ahead and cut these off here. And you're gonna be removing the teeth completely off the cord. Um, when I cut these off, sometimes I leave a little something and I just work it off later, but they need to come completely off the cord to keep it clean. So now we're going to start on the other side. Um, since we took two off on the left side, what was the left side, now it's the right side, we're going to take two off on this side also. And now we're going to go to the bottom and we're going to start buttoning the zipper up. And basically when you're buttoning a zipper up, all you have to do is just get the teeth to engage with each other or interlock with each other again. And you see here I'm just kind of pushing one end into the other and I'm moving my way up the teeth. <clears throat> Okay, so once you get the zipper basically buttoned up from the bottom up to the top, once you get to about the very top here, you're gonna put your slider on. Um, and this is just by simply putting it on one side first, here. Make sure that's in frame. Okay, so you got one side on the tape, and then you're gonna do the same thing with the other side. You're gonna pull the two sides together and get it on. And sometimes it'll it'll fall off, so you kinda of gotta just finagle it back on. Okay. So now I have the slider back on both sides. I'm going to finish buttoning this up together. Once you button them up, then the slider is gonna be able to engage and you should have a functioning zipper. So once you get that all buttoned up to the slider, you're gonna give the slider a little bit of a tug, pull on the, each side to get it engaged, and then you got it back on, okay? So you're just gonna double check that it functions fine, which this one does. Um, and then from here, we're gonna put on those top stops to keep the slider from coming off, and you're back in action. You're gonna take these top stops here, these are preformed top stops, and we're gonna put them right here on the cord. And because we had to cut some teeth off, you're gonna wanna cheat that top stop just a little bit up. Usually the, the bottom of the top stop and the first tooth are touching uh, with each other, but we're going to cheat that up. And I'm gonna use my pliers here, I'm gonna use the inside. And 
and I didn't crimp it all the way on yet because I'm going to move it around a little bit and just adjust it. But you crimp it right onto the tape. Uh, you're going to do the same thing with the other side and it'll be fixed. Okay, so I just finished putting on the other top stop here. So we did this one on the left side. We put the other top stop on uh, the tape. We take the slider up to the top, make sure the slider stops and the zipper is functioning again. And you have your bag back. So if you like what you've seen here, uh, please go ahead and hit that like button down below, that thumbs up. Um, please subscribe to our channel so that all of our zipper tutorials go directly to you. And if you have any questions, feel free to email me at Hiram at youcanzippers.com. The email address is here. Uh, email me and I'm happy to help out and see if we can figure out a solution for your zipper needs. And thanks.